So the question says, given the following stack operations, what are the contents of x, y, and z after all the operations are performed? So what we have to remember is a stack operation is last in, first out. So let's go ahead and do it. So let's say if this is our stack, we push 5, then we push 9, then we push 10 on the stack, then we pop and it's stored at x. So 10 is popped, stored at x. Then we push 13, push 15, pop y. So this is popped, y equals 15. Then we pop again, and that's pop z. This is popped, z equal 13. We pop it again, and that's pop z as well. So we pop 9. So 13 is overwritten, and the value of z is 9. So that's how you do stack operations.